What's up ladies and gentlemen, it's Brendan and I'm BmanX45 and today we're coming at you with another video. We have an update hobby news video for the Digimon TCG, a quick one. We're just going to go over the banned and restricted card list announcement that came out yesterday. Uh, as of uploading this, this is uh, May 27th in the morning. I didn't find out about the ban list until the evening, but I was working so I couldn't do anything about it. But uh, we're going to get into it right now. We're going to take a look at the new ban list and it was kind of a surprise, but uh, not not too bad one. So we're going to start off with the first uh, new one, effective June 1st is the new ban list. Blossommon from BT3. So the Digisorption 3 uh, basically playing itself for free has been limited to one. Um, I play Bloom Lord, and if you've watched my Bloom Lord profile on the list, I did play two, so I am going to have to change that. It's an easy change. It's really not that hard. You, you just play another Cherrymon. Uh, Cherrymon's Digisorption 2, so he Digivolves for one, which is still amazing for a level five. Digivolving for three is even better, but you get such good, great memory gain in that deck that you don't have to worry so much about uh, about having you know one one cost digivolutions versus zero cost. You now zero cost is nice. So this is going to be a top deck, like a, a great top deck, but it's not doesn't hurt the deck overall. So yeah, uh, and then EX2 Impmon. This made me a little sad because I love EX2 Impmon. The card art is amazing. Uh, the ability to search your Imakos. And your Beelzemon. So this is now one, unfortunately. Uh, it even has the best DP boost inheritable of 3,000 boost. So it, it, it is actually kind of sad. I understand why Beelzemon's so great. And without hitting uh, X antibody himself, it just makes sense that we would be in a place where we need to limit something. And, and this is, is I, I guess, I, it would kind of be a good hit. Um, your Imako is really powerful, and if you don't want to hit your Tamer, this is the op optimal choice. Um, I'm not sure how I'm going to play this. Like, So I do play four of this, so I'm losing three slots. Uh, I think for right now, I'm going to put in two BT6 Impmons and one BT2. I've seen people playing a 13th Rookie. I wasn't playing... Uh, 13th Rookie, which was the BT2 Impmon. So, uh, and I think they were, you know, cutting down. Yeah, they were just playing 13. I wasn't because I was playing other cards like BL Starmon and stuff like that uh, that I really like in the deck. Um, yeah, I, I'm, I'm going to try to BT6 because he gives you the ability to at least add your Bielzamons back when he's, uh, when he's summoned. So there's that. Uh, and I'm going to just the one, I think, the BT. Because you got such good mill in this deck. I mean, I guess you do lose something. Because now when you mill this Impmon, um, you can't mill this Impmon and mill an extra three consistently. But you have so many other good mill avenues that I feel like this is not the end of the road for the deck. It's, uh, it's an... We'll see how it goes. But I, I right now, I think for testing purposes at, at this moment, I'm thinking two BT6 Impmon could be strong. Especially because I run the BL, the one BL Star Mon. So she is a target as well. So I have lots of targets. Um, but we'll see what happens. So it's a little sad about this. But uh, overall, I mean, it just brings it into the Ultimate Cup format, really. Which is what it was already at. Okay. Where Garurumon? Uh, as many of you might know, I don't like Melga. I've never I've never built the deck myself, and I hate playing against it. So I'm like, yes, die. Um, no, it's unfortunate for players, but it, it is a really busted card. And with the announcement and the new uh, Metal Guru Mon support we are going to eventually get in the future because, hey, they love Metal Guru Mon, War Greymon, right? There, you know, there's like 12 different versions of, of, of all those cards. So I definitely think it was something that had to happen. You know, a lot of the changes they made were stuff that they made in the Ultimate Cup format. So they realized that it was, okay, well, this is a problem in you know for the game and we want to diversify the games so that a lot of the 
they just realized a lot of the problems that they were fixing in the Ultimate Cup format. They just needed to fix in the main game. Uh, lastly, we have Grand Kawagamon. Again, another thing that was in the Ultimate Cup limited to one is now limited to one in uh, Grandis, which is funny just because Grandis is, is still strong, but it's not seeing as much competitive play as it used to. So it just feels kind of late to the party, but it's understandable, especially with future support. It, you know, it's, it's, it's a great card. Uh, I played the deck. I loved it. It was really fun. I decided to switch over for other green decks, but uh, I still think this is one of my favorite decks to play. It was Grand Kawagamon back in the day, and then Grandis back in BT9. So it's understandable again. Not, you know, it, it's a pretty good list. I got to say, it's a, it's a pretty good list. Um, they did a good job. I think that it's going to move things forward. We'll see what happens with other decks. Uh, if there's any other power creep that needs to be balanced so you know it's uh it's a, overall I, I i don't think it hurts too bad i'm sad about the impmon but that's the way they go sometimes but uh you know drop a comment down below tell me what you think what you think they could have done what you think about what they did do if you are having any idea if you have any ideas for beelzebon if if you think my idea is right or you think uh i could play different cards uh anyways Thank you guys for checking out this video. I really appreciate it. Uh, I always like to do these hobby news videos and I hope you guys enjoy them. Looks like that's all the time we have for this video. If you enjoyed today's content, be sure to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell for notifications so you don't miss a single minute of the fun. And that's all for now, folks.